My name is Krishmin. I'm a wildlife photographer and filmmaker. I make films to raise awareness of the need for conservation in Africa. My most recent video was shot with the Sony Alpha 7S III in the Serengeti in Tanzania to draw attention to the fragility of this amazing ecosystem. All these beautiful things that's happening, it's very fragile and if we want to, to show it to our, our children, we need to protect it. The first time I learned about the Sony Alpha 7S III, very exciting about the 4K 50-60p in 4 to 2 10 bits. But also what was amazing it was the possibility to shoot very slow motion at 100 and 120p, also in 4K in 4 to 2 10 bits. When you have a lot of movement and splash, and especially with water and dust, it makes everything dramatic. By having 4 to 2 10 bits in post-production, I have much more flexibility to grade my footage, so it opens also a new world for grading. The dynamic range of the camera is amazing because I can recover details in highlight and shadow better than before. And what's exciting is I can easily match the footage that is coming from my traditional professional video camera. I can totally rely on the Sony Alpha 7S III The main setup for the gimbal, we had a black arm fixed on the front of the car. The end of the black arm was the gimbal. Then on the gimbal was a Sony Alpha 7S III with the Sony G Master 70 to 200. From the camera, we have then a full-size HDMI cable going to an external recorder to record in ProRes RAW. The Sony A7S III I can use for the very first time autofocus in video, which wasn't possible before. So you just tap on the screen where you want to focus. Then it was tracking the lions even when he was walking uh, behind the grass and we still get uh, a sharp shot, which was amazing. When we are on location, specifically in Africa, we have uh, a lot of heat coming and dust during the day with direct sunlight on top of the camera and we didn't have any issue with overheating at all. There is only a few cameras that you can use in low light and push as much as you can with the Sony Alpha 7S III. We were following a young leopard. We were able to film this leopard during the night. So we were able to, to push the ISO and film this leopard totally in darkness. With my eyes I can see anything, but I, when I was looking at the screen of the camera, it was like during the day. So working with wildlife photography and filmmaking, you have only one chance. And if you miss it, that's over. So that's important for me to be able to, to shoot any time, at any time of the day. Now with the Sony S7S III, you can open a brand new world of storytelling that wasn't possible before. So I can push the limits and I can film key moments really to show this beauty and to protect this amazing wildlife.